Um, good evening, guys, or good morning, depending on where you are in the world. I am at uh, one of my best friend's house here, and she's doing mm, salt and pepper added. It's going to be it's a recipe about fish and couscous. Why couscous? Because is couscous is used a lot in African cuisine, and she's a very good cook. She so put in some onions, then some pepper. As you can see, what she's doing. And a bit later on, she's going to add uh, some fresh cream, as you will see. Anyway, so the oil is already added anyway. So she, and then now she's added the curd to it. And you know what? When I tasted that dish, oh, it was so beautiful. So, so nice. Anyway, by looking at it, it makes me want to do it again, to do the same uh, recipe. So that a cube. That she's going to add so she calls it the magic cube. Yes, I can say it was really magic, absolutely wonderful, absolutely great. Yeah, so that way it looks like to start with. And uh, then she adds some pepper, uh, black pepper, she's adding, and also white pepper at some point. Yeah, here we are. So she pepper added, yeah, absolutely. I can just mention. And the uh, white pepper now, I think, and uh, some salt. Okay. Here we are. After that, as you can see, the top of going under, we going slowly. So we see, we add a bit. What did we add? You'll find in a minute. Curry. Yes, absolutely. Give it some taste, actually. And uh, even though I don't like spicy cuisine myself, but the way she's done it is really good. Because it's just part of an ensemble of, of uh, all things, isn't it? So it's not like just on its own. So white pepper as well, parzon. And let's be patient here. And piri piri, yes. And as I said, I don't like, personally, I probably don't like uh, spicy cuisine, but the way it was done, it was really good. So mixing again, yeah, in in a pan, yeah, as you can see, so that one it doesn't stick on the uh, on the pan, and two it mixes well. And as you can see in the background, at the back of the picture, yeah, yeah a fine pan, uh, a normal pan with water in it. So you you will see what we do with that afterwards. So now when she adding mm, some fresh cream, that's really really good. And she's a good cook too. Yeah, I really congratulated her on that. And it's not a main activity, but she's really a good cook. And I really like the way she did it. So it's a kind of uh, mixture between, uh, let's say, European cuisine and African cuisine. African cuisine, as you may guess, or may know already, is a very st spicy uh, style of cuisine. And I think we just seen a couscous box here. Then that we're going to add. Oh, I have to ask her to do that dish again <laughs> because it's really nice. She, she did it about three weeks ago. Yeah, so you must make sure that the gas is not too high underneath because obviously you don't want it to burn out. Good quality uh, oh, salt, absolutely. That's what I mentioned a bit earlier, adding some salt. And obviously she's going to mix it again. It's nice, isn't it? It looks nice. A bit more fresh cream. <laughs> yeah, and then she mixes it again. Now, oh, she's added some water. Yes, absolutely. That's something I tend to forget sometimes myself. So, so it's a good thing that to, to remember it. Oh, it's nice, isn't it? I'm sure people all over here watching this video, mm, I think I'm sure you will want to eat that again. Or if you haven't, to try it. Yeah, it looks beautiful, isn't it? It looks really nice. So let's look at, uh, so here we are, that's where it looks when, uh, when we zoom in. Cover it to make sure that uh, it just, uh, <coughs> Just good properly and appropriately. Here we are. That's uh, now the uh, 
water is boiling as you can see and it's peeping out so what's next let's wait for it let's discover what next very good isn't it absolutely very good the water is still boiling but she 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 boils it by you know when she's made most of the uh, cooking in the uh, frying pan uh, before the water is boiling otherwise it's just a waste of gas and energy and water isn't it so it's so important to do it at the right time mm, i can imagine eating this meal again right so like a little pause here watch uh, next important to see what's going to happen it's happening uh, still boiling two minutes couple of minutes yeah she's adding some salt in the water here we are what's going now in that is the couscous and i must say when I, when I tested the couscous, it's been a long time since I had some couscous. So the here we are. And uh, right, okay. As you can see, I added a little bit of water afterwards. So it doesn't stick too much. That's what I would do anyway. I can't remember whether she's doing it. I think she had it somewhere. I'm not 100% sure. Yeah. I would add some personally, but it might just be okay. But the couscous was very nice. Yeah, she's adding some water like I would have done. So I remember my lesson very well here. Yeah? I've learned what I should be learning. <laughs> okay so that's uh, that's right and uh, you will see the finished product in uh, in a short while so i would say fish with couscous or cod and couscous i don't think we have a specific name i search for it but i would just call it cod and couscous dish and uh, with uh, uh, a lot of uh, when she prepared the sauce uh, she had it freshly made the end and that makes it so nice and just appropriate actually it's very very nice and it makes the the uh, i've noticed the, the taste of it when i when i add the um, share of that as you can see on my plate the couscous with the with the sauce the way she prepared it is beautiful but for some reason then i didn't have any sauce left and i had a little bit of couscous left at the end and the taste of the couscous for me anyways my opinion is much better with the sauce on it that's just my opinion that's just my personal opinion so guys if you want to try this at home please do huh? try this at home there is no danger you can try this at home okay and then it's very very nice ingredient for the, the fish dish i ask for the cold salt oil onions talk cubes curry black pepper white pepper basil parsley peri peri fresh cream 